life changing, scary, hard. It's surreal. It's more beautiful than, than in the books. You know, everyone's asking me, uh, where are you going to go for school? What's, where are you going to go for university? And I tell them, well, this is my Camino University. Hi, we are Eric and Ricky. We not only walk Camino de Santiago and try the best food, but we also help others in the preparation and ask them important questions. Today we'll ask, what is the Camino for you? I'm Lidvin Passon from the Seychelles. I am 55 years old. And which Camino did you just walk? Um, it's our first time on the Camino and we chose the Camino Portuguese from Vigo to Santiago. My name is Austin Strelo. I'm from Kansas City, Kansas. And I'm 18, I've just turned 18. So, young guy, little Nino. <laughs> Nino, Nino. Yeah, yeah. Which Camino did you just complete? Uh, the French Camino, the Frances, uh, from Saint Jean. So, 779 kilometers, about that. Who knows? Yeah. Who knows, really? I am Araceli Espi, I am 49 years old, and I, am, I live in the United States in the state of Washington. Which Camino did you do? Did you uh, the Camino del Norte. Mm -hmm. Is it your first Camino? No, this is my second Camino. I'm 62, my name's Clive Wright and I'm from Durban, South Africa. And you just finished? I just finished this morning. I walked the Camino Francis from St. John Pierre de Paul to Santiago. Oh. Uh, my name is Amy Rulo. I'm 63 and I'm from Cape Cod in Massachusetts on the United, in the United States. Which Camino did you just complete? I did the Francis. It was inspiring. It was a little strange at the beginning, but then um, we've only been on the Camino for seven, eight days. And then he got into it. And towards the end, then we started making a lot of friends. And it's just coming here, arriving at Santiago, it's surreal. It's more beautiful than, than in the books and on uh, films. But yeah, we loved it. Is it your first Camino? No, this is my second Camino. And why did you decide to come back? Because my friends uh, hear my story that I did the Camino Frances and they decide uh, to do a Camino and they choose the Camino del Norte. How was it? It was amazing, life-changing, scary, hard. I mean, everything I imagined it was going to be and more. Was it your first Camino? Yes, first Camino. And uh, inspired by you, oh. Camino tellers. <laughs> I've watched so many of the, the YouTube stuff and it's inspirational and I enjoy it. So much. Um, it proved to me that you can't fear things in your life. You have to do them. Like if you spend your life in fear, over dying or being sick or things that is my mother experienced all that and she didn't get to do anything so I did this and I never had any of the fear that it's funny I have at home when I'm just sitting around doing nothing Camino I was always busy and I didn't think about it and it was just the best thing to realize that even at my age with and I love to walk I walk at home all the time but I still made it and I overcame so much and so you don't have to be scared to live. You just do it and it works out for you. The Camino for me is, um, it showed me like there is a beginning of, like represents the beginning of the life but we arrive to an end and it's the journey of life. Camino for me, it's in a world that is very turbulent right now. It's about people coming together, back to basics, with very little instead of the material world and having the love, peace and love, which we need right now a lot in the world. We actually met an old uh, pilgrim on the Camino, just with her little, his little stuff, doing the peace and love thing, which we were very, very impressed and this is what we should have and the Camino can bring about the peace and love that we need right now in the world. And it was great and I met the, some of the best people and they helped me. Everybody supported me. I just ran into some people that I started with who have been here for like a week 
and they were like so happy that I didn't give up because the last time I saw them, I was in Lyon and thinking about giving up, and they were crying that I didn't, I didn't give up. So it, it was the best thing ever. It really was. What does Camino de Santiago mean to you? Oh, it's um, it's direction. You know, it's I'm walking forward for most of the time, and but I think it's really just pointing me towards that next direction. It's it's. It's showing me my heart's direction, what, to follow my heart, and it's, it's teaching me to listen a lot more. Listen to your body, listen to God, listen to the people who love you. <laughs> like, it's amazing to think that God has, it's so beautiful that God has something else a storage for us in the future. So it's just an amazing experience for me, yeah. You know, everyone's asking me, uh, where are you going to go for school? What's, where are you going to go for university? And I tell them, well, this is my Camino University. And I say, now you're my professor. And I feel like I'm getting all these subjects, history, science, you know, culture, language. And like the biggest subject I'm learning is gratitude. You know, I'm like, everywhere I go, I'm learning to be grateful. And I'm being humbled every second, like hand wringing my clothes out and like taking care of my feet. And yeah, it's, it's beautiful. It teaches you to appreciate all these things you've never thought of. And the perfect thing for a young person to do, I think. It's one of the things that teaches the way of life and reminds you of the things that you're not doing that you should be doing and where you can correct to make yourself a better human being. Thank you. Hearing those inspiring stories, you might be feeling motivated to start your Camino journey. Before you embark, consider joining us on a special retreat that is designed to prepare you both physically and mentally. Our retreat offers personal guidance, expert advice, and a supportive community to ensure you're ready for adventure ahead. Sign up to secure your spot and start your Camino with confidence. Click the link below to learn more and register for our pre-Camino retreat. Don't miss this opportunity to make your Camino experience truly unforgettable.